Meanwhile, news tonight about a family name and business well known and loved across western New York. Today, the DiCamillo family announced that they are closing the doors of one of their first locations. Joining the sides, Liz Lewin has the latest from Niagara Falls tonight. It's simply very difficult for me to ask an employee to continue to, to work there. DiCamillo Bakery has been a staple in the Western New York community for over 100 years, with locations throughout Erie and Niagara counties. Over the weekend, one of the family's most sentimental locations on Pine Avenue in Niagara Falls shut its doors until further notice, after it was robbed. These are our people, and we need to keep them safe. In a post on Facebook, the family stated in part, quote, at this time, our priority is the safety of our great employees. Our employees here at the bakery, and I speak at all locations for every employee we have, they've been phenomenal. By and large, they've been phenomenal. They work hard. They're loyal, fiercely loyal, and they do a terrific job. Matthew D. Camillo is the vice president of the family business and says a young man wearing a mask came into the bakery on Saturday afternoon, asked for all the money, and showed a gun to the manager and clerk on duty. No employees were injured, but DiCamillo says it was a scary experience for the entire team and that the robber walked away with a few hundred dollars. In recent months, he says the increase in crime in that neighborhood has been a growing concern. More specifically for us, that Pine Avenue location has seen uh, a definite uptick in crime in the last four or five years around our store uh, and involving our store. And it's been, uh, you know, scary. DiCamillo says the robber was later identified by security footage and caught by Niagara Falls police. Two on your side reached out to NFPD and a city spokesperson for further details into the investigation, but have yet to hear back. It's definitely had an uptick. Um, we have, and we've tried uh, many things to try and help it, um, and it's, but it has not gotten too much better. The DiCamillo family says the decision to close their Pine Avenue location has been tough for everyone, but it's what needed to be done. As for employees there, the family says no one will lose their job. We can reallocate their roles and, and the, the, those employees that were impacted in this store and no one will, will lose a job and they'll all be able to work someplace else. In Niagara Falls, Liz Lewin, Channel 2 News.